Mr. Ayala, you're charged out of the 209th District Court, Judge Mike McSpadden, with the offense of capital murder. On 4-24-2017, officers make a capital murder scene off of Sherwood Drive. Um, complainant's husband uh, was in arrested on March 25th of 2017 and incarcerated. He was arrested on March 25th. Uh, it looks like officers are going to find that several items were missing from the house. A compressor, a generator, tires, lawnmower, nail guns. A television, laptop, and a white Ford F-350 truck. Uh, a witness neighbor who lives across the street said he had seen complainant on March 21st. Between 4.30 and 5 p.m. Witness stated uh, she went inside the house with her dogs. He heard a loud noise like you would throw something heavy onto a trailer or in the bed of a pickup truck. About 10 to 15 minutes later, he saw the white colored F-350 that he knew was the complainants racing down the street. Uh, given the level of the deep decomposition, Friday was the day the complainant was killed and the truck had been driven by the suspects after the killing. I'm sorry, so can you say that and that again? Sure. Given the level of decomposition, Friday was the day she was killed, and the truck had been driven by the suspects after the killing. On April 25th, 2017, officers are going to meet with Mr. Ayala at the detention center. Uh, he verified that the gates were always locked. Uh, he kept assorted tools, nail guns, and handsaw. Uh, compressors and generators. His, uh, in his truck at his house there are five new tires and they had re recently purchased a large television set in their bedroom. Officer had seen a cell phone plugged into the charger at the house. Um, and this turned out to be Mr. Ayala's phone. Uh, complainants was missing and unaccounted for at the scene. Uh, 
Mr. Ayala is going to be uh, spoken with on April the 28th of 2017. He acknowledges he has two brothers, Noe and Moises. who lived at the house. Um, they had access to his gates and house as the key fit all the locks. Uh, the dogs knew the, his brothers. Officers are going to get a Crime Stoppers tip Uh, the tipster stated the killer's name was M Moses. And he had become enraged once he found out the victim had something to do with his brother's arrest. Uh, officers are going to interview Moses Ayala. Uh, he is going to give a statement and confess to killing the complainant. To get even for sending his brother to jail. Then taking his brother's tools and truck to sell. Court finds probable cause, bail is set, no bond. Personal bond referred to the trial court. Um, sir, are you asking that a lawyer be appointed to represent you in this case? Now, if you're not a United States citizen, you may be entitled to have us notify your country's consular representative here in the United States. Do you want us to notify your country's consular officials? No, Judge. He's from El Salvador. Very well. Step to the left. Go to the deputies.